guys, and thanks for stopping by my channel. So this is just gonna be a short, sweet video. These are just some cards that I got for my birthday and I wanted to share them with you. Also, this was a card that my husband got me for our anniversary. It, it just, he just wrote, I love you, happy anniversary to another 14 years. Cause we did celebrate our 14 year anniversary on July 17th. So he got me that card and I just thought I'd throw it in here, but it's my birthday tomorrow, but I probably won't, I don't know when I'm going to post this, but my birthday is August 8th, right? So the first card I want to share with you, I already opened it. It was from my mom and it says 40. You know, so I don't forget that I'm 40. A brand new decade of possibilities. And it says, if this year is anything like you, it's going to be a great one. Cute, happy 40th birthday. It says to my beautiful daughter, Tiffany, I will never forget the day you were born was one of the happiest days of my life. I love you, mom. My mom is so awesome. We had a very rocky start in life. <laughs> Teenage years were a little, a little difficult, but our relationship now is great. It's great. I love my mom so much. Thank you, mom, if you're watching this. Okay, the next card I wanna show you is from my grandparents. And this one says, wishing your silly self. And they picked out a little doggy card a positively awesome birthday. And it says, happy birthday, Tiffany. And then it says my grandma, my grandpa, and my aunt's on here. And it says, he sent me a little something, something. My grandfather said, don't spend this on a tattoo. And when I saw that, I laughed and I said, oh my gosh, I have to show people on YouTube. <laughs> so don't spend this on a tattoo because he and I have gone through lengthy discussions about why people like tattoos. He's very like very much against them and I'm very much for them. You know, um, he's in his seventies and you know, the thing is he was in the Navy, but he never got a tattoo. He comes from a different time period, you know, where tattoos are like kind of trashy, you know, and, and, and social acceptance has changed. Do you hear that? Are you watching? I'm going to send you the link to this video and see if I get any. Tell my grandfather in the comments down below that tattoos are okay. I would appreciate that. That's what you could do for me on my birthday. I don't know when this is going to go up, but if we could get enough people to tell Grandpa Dave that he's wrong and tattoos are okay, that would make me really happy and it doesn't cost you anything. <laughs> All right, the last card I got is from Patty's Place and uh, it does have a cute little puppy on it. All right, so let's see. And then we've got some stickers over here as well. Not sure what this is for, if this is a thank you because I sent her that, I sent her a wine bracelet. Um, so this might be like a thank you. I'm not entirely sure, but okay. Oh no. Okay. I thought this was one of those joke cards because it's thick. I thought it was one of those joke cards that I sent Kim from Kimmy's boxes that doesn't stop laughing or meowing or whatever. I did that to her. Yeah, I did. It was, it was worth it. It says greetings from California. <laughs> Whoo! <laughs> Safe. There's something um, stuck here. We'll get to that in a second. Look, she, she has really nice handwriting. I've never seen her handwriting before and it looks really nice. It says, Dear Tiffitha, just wanted to say thanks so much for the awesome booze bracelet. Can't wait to use it in Vegas. So I was thinking, what could I send Tiffany to show my appreciation for her enabling my binge drinking in Vegas? <laughs> LOL. I wasn't trying to enable you. I was just, uh, and I thought, well, of course a food chat. Uh, this is a food challenge. I thought it was like a little souvenir from Vegas or something. So Fern and I will be on a quest. Oh, okay. In the deepest and darkest parts of the markets out here to find the perfect thing. Oh, it's not here yet. I still have time and we will find it, LOL. But until then, here's a little something inedible from Vegas, P.S. 
Bella and Lola said hi to everyone. Well, Lola did at least. LOL, XOXO, Patty, AKA Patty's Place. If you guys don't know Patty's Place, you gotta check her out. I'll leave her description. Oh, I say that every time. I'll leave her link in the description box below. She does haul videos mostly and she's a riot. Bella and Lola are her dogs and I love them. Lola is a chihuahua, so like I have a chihuahua, you know, and Lola is like a sweet dog and then Bella is kind of like a stuck up snob, but we love Bella too. Like she's just a little judgmental, but it's okay. I happily accept any food challenge you could find, Patty. As long as it can get to me in a safe way, I'm fine with eating it. So the thing that she attached, I think I know what it is. Um, and I feel special because she only bought so many of these and I get to be one of the lucky people to receive one. I know Kim from Kimmy's Place got one and I was like, that thing is really cool. And let me just show you. It is a lucky chip from Las Vegas. And it says it's $100, but it's not really like a betting chip. It's just like a souvenir, but it's still really, really cool. And I'm gonna, I need to find like a good use for this. Um, is it magnetized? Cause I would put this on the fridge. If it's not magnetized, maybe I'll use it to scratch lottery tickets or something. I don't know. But anyways, thank you Patty for the lovely card. Thank you grandma and grandpa and my aunts and my mom for the lovely cards. I just like to show my appreciation, plus the ever elusive content. I will have more videos to come as I have more things coming to me, but that is all I have in today's filming day. This is the last video I'm filming today. I don't know when it's going out, but thank you so much for hanging out and sharing the day with me, sharing the video with me, and the love. And until next time, I'll see ya. Bye. Um, hell yeah, it's magnetized. Look at that. Okay, cool. <laughs> All right, bye.